this video i'm going to be making a scratch game in only 30 minutes so let's start okay the time starts in three two one go okay so i'm planning to make a shooter game let's start off by creating the player leave the cat sprite let's create a new sprite called player i'm going to make the head blue for the player increase the outline for the arms i'm going to make it like this, something like this and here is the second arm for the hands i'm going to use some circles like this and like this for the gun i'm going to make a simple rectangle like this i hope it looks good i'll just resize this a bit it looks too big let me adjust this and uh, here's the player now for the movement i'll do in green flag click go to x0 y0 forever change x change y d minus key a pressed then for this i'm going to do change y by w minus key s pressed and basically to add some speed i'm going to multiply it by phi like that into phi also let's point towards mouse pointer now as you can see our player is able to move man i spent four minutes just for the player movement okay now for the bullets let's just create a new sprite i'm going to call it bullets and a bullet is nothing fancy it's just a small rectangle i'll do something like this and let me shrink it a bit and yeah i think this looks good so i'm going to do n green flag clicked hide when i start as a clone show go to player point in direction direction of player and move something like 15 steps so that it can go to the gun repeat until touching edge then let's move something like 15 steps and then after that like, i'm just going to delete this clone and then just to shoot the bullet i'm going to do any in fact like forever if mouse down wait 0.1 second create clone of bullets okay now this should work okay seems like the bullets are shooting from his head let me just fix it Okay, so I seem to fix it. Now let's move on to the enemies. I'll just create a new sprite, call it enemy, copy, paste, nothing much to modify. I'll just remove this gun and I'll just change the color of this enemy. Okay, so they're basically zombies which have hands that are stretched out. Now to code them, I'll do when green flag click, right, forever. I'll say wait two seconds, create clone of myself. And I start as a clone, show. And I want them to go in one of these four sides. So I'll just code that. So I'll make a new block called choose side run without screen refresh i'll create a new variable called side for this sprite only i'll set it to pick random one to four as there are four sides and then i'll check if it is equal to one now here i'll put the choose side repeat until not touching edge move three steps then repeat until touching edge move three steps also let's just point towards the player here and then at the end i'll just delete this clone okay so the enemies are spawning they're too fast so i'm just reducing the steps to two let's see if that works okay that should be good now i have something like 17 minutes remaining so let's do some bullet collision so when i start as a clone forever if the bullet is touching the enemy let's wait zero seconds then let's just delete this clone i'm doing this wait zero seconds for some bullet collision and then the enemy when i start as a clone forever if touching bullets wait zero seconds then delete this clone now whenever i shoot the enemies they die so it's time to add some lives to the enemies I'll just create a new variable called lives, the sprite only. I'll set it to something like 2 in the beginning. Then whenever we are touching the bullets, I'll just change it by minus 1. Then when the enemy has no lives, let's just delete this clone. And also add a nice effect whenever it gets shot. So what this does is the brightness is set to 50. It waits for 0 0.05 seconds and sets it back to 0. Let me hide the live sprite. Okay, now the enemy has some lives. Now it's time to add some scoring system so I'll just create a new variable called score. I'll set it to 0 in the beginning. I'll just change it to large readout and center it. And whenever it touches an enemy I'll just change score by 1. Well, let's just change the score by 1 whenever the enemy dies. And yeah the scoring system works nicely. Okay it's high time I add a backdrop. Convert to bitmap. Okay so this is the color I've chosen. I mean this looks good. Okay so there's not much of a challenge so I'm just going to add a game over system. So I'll do any green flag click forever if touching enemy let's just stop all i might change it later if i have time okay it works so what i'm mainly focusing on is adding more enemies and i have only 10 minutes remaining so let me just duplicate this and change the color this time it's a green zombie and yeah i mean this looks good
ओके सो दिस शुड वर्क ओके सो दिस इज वर्किंग वेरी वेल सो वेन एवर ग्रीन जॉम बी डाइज द प्लेयर शुड चेंज इट स्कोर मोर सो वॉट आई एम गोइंग टू डू इज इफ एन एम ई टाइप इज इक्वल टू टू आई जस्ट चेंज द स्कोर बाई टू आई गेस एंड देन एल्स इट विल बी वन सो जस्ट चेंज स्कोर बाई वन दिस इज वर्किंग वेरी वेल नो आई हैव सम एट मिनट्स रिमेनिंग आई थिंक आई कैन एड प्लेयर लाइव नो लेट मी जस्ट डू दैट लेट मी जस्ट क्रिएट ए न्यू वेरिएबल कॉल प्लेयर लाइव आई सेट इट टू फाइव और समथिंग नो आई सेट इट टू थ्री एंड देन आई जस्ट क्रिएट ए न्यू स्प्राइट कॉल लाइव ओके सो आई टुक दिस हार्ट कॉस्ट्यूम मीन टू मॉडिफाई इट सो दैट कैन शो फाइव हार्ट ओ वेट आई सेट द लाइव टू थ्री लेट मी जस्ट रिमूव दिस टू हार्ट सेंटर दिस थ्री हार्ट एंड आई एम गोइंग टू कॉल दिस कॉस्ट्यूम थ्री एंड डुप्लीकेट रिमूव वन हार्ट देन सेंटर दिस एंड डुप्लीकेट एंड देन सेट दिस टू वन मूव वन हार्ट वन हार्ट रिमेन्स इन द कोड आई डू एन ग्रीन फ्लैग क्लिक फॉर एवर वील चेक इफ प्लेयर लाइव इज इक्वल टू थ्री स्विच कॉस्ट्यूम टू थ्री इफ प्लेयर लाइव इज इक्वल टू टू स्विच कॉस्ट्यूम टू टू प्लेयर लाइव इज इक्वल टू वन आई जस्ट स्विच इट टू वन एल्स इट विल बी इक्वल टू जीरो जस्ट गोइंग टू हाइड इट एंड देन शो इट इन ऑल द रेस्ट ऑल द अदर केसेस एम ऑल्सो गोइंग टू प्लेस इट हियर एक्चुअली आई मैंने प्लेस इट इन द सेंटर वो टू एक्स जीरो एंड देन वाई माइनस वन फिफ्टी एंड एंड इन द प्लेयर स्प्राइट आई गोइंग टू डू इफ टचिंग एनमी चेंज प्लेयर लाइव बाई माइनस वन एंड देन आई डोंट वॉन्ट द एनमी टू कंटिन्यूसली डाइस एम जस्ट गोइंग टू एड अ डिले समथिंग लाइक पॉइंट फोर आई गेस आई डोंट नो एक्चुअली आई मेक अ डिले ऑफ वन सेकेंड ओके सो द लाइव सिस्टम वर्क इट्स नॉट शोइंग द हार्ट बिकॉज आई डोंट हैव एनी लाइव रिमेनिंग now whenever we don't have any lives let's just stop the game so so if player lives is less than 1 let's just stop all okay so it works but whenever we stop the project it shows one heart remaining so to fix that i'm going to broadcast a new message called hide heart when i receive hide hearts let's just hide and that works so now i have some 2 minutes remaining i'll just add a few labels and let's see Oh, two seconds remaining, and the time is up. And yeah, that's the game I created in 30 minutes. This game can be much better, so I might work on it more on future videos. So make sure to stay subscribed. I also might share this on my Scratch profile. I don't know. Comment down below if you want to see this in my Scratch profile. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers. It really means a lot. And yeah, thanks for watching.